This tutorial will show you in detail how to create invoices using Express Invoice. Click the Invoice button on the toolbar to open the new invoice window. Begin by filling out the billing and shipping tabs for the customer you are invoicing. Enter a customer name or select an existing customer from the drop menu. Note that any new customer you type in here will be saved automatically as a customer record, which you can edit later, or access for future quotes, orders, and invoices. Similarly, the customer's billing and shipping information will also be saved with the customer record when you enter it here. Also on the Billing tab, you have the option to specify any existing customer PO number you may need to include, and you can select a tax specific to the customer. On the Shipping tab, select or enter the shipping company and the tracking number for the shipment and include any shipping costs that should be added to the order. Now fill in the Invoice tab. The Create From drop menu allows you to create the invoice from an existing quote, order, or draft invoice. But usually, you'll keep the New Invoice option selected. Select the date the invoice was created the terms for the invoice payment, which is used for determining the payment due date, and enter or select a salesperson if applicable. The table on the invoice form is where you enter the invoice items or services. Click in the table to add an item. The item and description cells can be clicked again to pull up a menu of existing items, or you can type in a new item, which will save the item details in a new item record. Adjust the quantity amount and verify the unit value and tax are correct. Remove any item from the invoice list by clicking the trash can to the right of the item entry. Note that deleting an item in an invoice does not affect the master item list. Use the Notes section to enter additional notes to the customer or for your reference. Comments will be printed on the invoice. Private comments are for your reference only. When you are ready to save the invoice, you need to select how you want to record the invoice. The Record button will reflect the last record action you chose, but to select from all the options, click the triangle on the right side of this button. You can choose to record the payment with the action you use for sending the invoice to the customer. For example, if you want to print the invoice while you record it, select Record and Print. You can also save the invoice as a draft and come back to finish it later. Or save it as a recurring invoice so you don't have to enter identical invoices every billing period. You have just seen how to create a new invoice using Express Invoice. For more business software from NCH Software, click the address shown on your screen.